House and City Council member Delia Garza is defending herself against criticism over some of the things she's paid for with your money. She says it's legal. A former Travis County judge says she should have paid out of her own pocket. Monty Salazar is here. And Monty, what kind of expenses are we talking about? Well, Mike, Jenny, we have several receipts. They show council member Garza paid to renew her law license and continuing education fees out of her city budget. She says her license is beneficial to taxpayers, but we spoke with another attorney who disagrees. Taxpayers didn't even pay for the coffee in the county judge's office for the 12 years I was there. Former Travis County Judge Bill Aylshire thinks taxpayers should know where their money is going. Voters can judge that for themselves. If they think this is okay, then fine, but I can't imagine how it's even legal. He had concerns about a new candidate running in the Travis County attorney's race. Mayor Pro Tem Delia Garza, he put in a public information request to find out her law license status. Aylshire found out the city paid for her bar dues in 2018 and 2019. It also paid for the Bench Bar Conference, Austin Bar Association dues, and a Spanish class in Costa Rica, all adding up to more than $1,000. I'm concerned, first of all, about the ethics of it. If she would abuse her office with a small office budget as a city council member, what's she going to do when she's in charge of hundreds of employees and $23 million? A city of Austin spokesman says council members manage their own budget, submitting expenditures through city staff to process payments. He says there are no provisions in the city charter or financial policies that prevent such an expenditure as long as it serves a municipal purpose. It's considered a benefits for people to have that extra knowledge, extra experience, ex ex extra expertise. Garza says she reactivated her license to help the Latino community in her district. And the continued education benefits those people. I believe this is less about what my office should or should not have paid for and more about Mr. Alshar not thinking I should be um, the elected county attorney of Travis County. Aylshire says he's given money to the other two candidates in the race, but still thinks taxpayer money should be used somewhere else. It would be a professional expense if she was an attorney in the attorney in the city attorney's office. That would be a professional expense. But as a member of the city council, that's not a professional expense. She has has nothing to do with her job as being a city council member. And I reached out to council member Ann Kitchen, who is an attorney too, and she says she paid for her bar dues with her own money. And Mayor Steve Adler is also an attorney, but we never heard back if he paid for his own bar expenses. Mr. Alshire did file a formal complaint to the city's integrity unit. Marty Salazar, KVU News.